Wheeler joining us here at the press conference for the uh, Ironman 70.3 here at Staffordshire. Will, you gave Javier uh, Gomez a fabulous uh, present uh, this afternoon. What was that about? Yeah, he's um, he's a good friend of mine, and um, I wanted to welcome him to the to the to the local area, our local area. So I, uh, I brought him a pork pie and um, and, a, and, a, and a couple of scotch eggs for him to enjoy tonight. And would you eat the pork pie and the scotch eggs? Are we trying to slow him down for tomorrow? I kind of wanted to bring a knife and um, and crack open here just so I can make sure that that, he, that he's eating. And make sure he's grateful, but. <laughs> I think I'll let him off. He'll, yeah, he he'll did put it in his fridge. And yeah, I think he did kind of hide it fairly quickly <laughs> under the table. I was like, I'm not eating this. Uh, Lucy, you spoke earlier about the, uh, the how special it is to race here on home soil. It's uh, going to be a great day tomorrow. Hopefully the weather will uh, will clear up a bit. What are you most looking forward to uh, about tomorrow? Uh, it's been a while since I've raced in England. Um, yeah, it's good old, good old Brits. There's loads of people out there that I know racing. and. Um, yeah, people I've met along the way over over the years, which makes it makes it pretty special. So yeah, it's not an A race, but I want to give it a good shot. Um, yeah, you turn up and you get excited. So, are you aiming to go long again this year? Will you race in Bolton or Wales this year with us? Yeah, I'm doing Bolton, so that's um, that's really my target. But yeah, this would be a good stepping stone. And of course, I want both of you to come to Ireland to the uh, inaugural 70.3 in Dublin this year. <laughs> Will, how's your uh, recovery gone from Ironman a few weeks ago? Are you set and ready for tomorrow? Was it an A race for you? Yeah, pretty well actually. I mean, I was expecting um, to come up to come up a lot worse, but um, I feel fresh and um, energy levels feel as good as ever, really. So, um, so yeah, I'm feeling. I'm excited to see what happens, and um, you know, there's there's no pressure. I, I wasn't expecting, to be honest, to be on to be on fire here. So, but I thought, but I think I can do a good performance, and I think I can I can do something. So. Uh, yeah, looking forward to it. And is there a lot of competition between yourself and uh, Javier for tomorrow? You know. Yeah, I mean, it's he, he'll for sure take take some beating, but um, but we'll um, you know there's two of us, me and my teammate Roman, and we've got a few dirty tricks up, up our sleeve, so we'll um, you know we're within the rules. So. <laughs> Just get that in there. He's got dirty tricks within the rules. And uh, Lucy, what about you? Who will you be looking over your shoulder at tomorrow? Well, my we'll landlady is definitely yes, getting my scalp. Yes, I saw <laughs> Susie uh, was carried behind you in uh, yeah. uh, recently in, in South Africa. So uh, yeah, you know, I've got a sneaky feeling it might be her turn tomorrow, but I don't know. We'll see. I feel good, but um, yeah, she's 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 gunning for me. So <laughs> <laughs> I'll smile when it happens. She told you she was going to put up the rent after your last race. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, Hopefully it well hasn't happened. <laughs> there were there were words. <laughs> Ho hopefully not. Well, listen. Uh, we wish you the best of luck, and uh, we'll see you on the start line tomorrow, bright and early. Thank cool. you.